And I'm going to World Market to look at some coffee beans, actually. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Good morning, it's a rainy Sunday to go going to church, but we're going to church. It is a rainy Sunday, but we're still gonna go. Cause it's really not that bad. Actually, I kind of like it. This is kind of like my favorite type of rain. It's really? just kind of rainy. It's, it's rainy. Like, it's a tease. Yeah. It's like, yeah. are you going to, or are you going, are you not? Yeah, when I'm out and about, I like this. But when I'm at home, I like more of a steady drizzle, <laughs> but this is okay, I like this. Hey, happy November 1st. It's my yeah. birthday month. It's her birthday month. Let's celebrate. What's up guys, church was great. Anna is going right over there to buy uh, beauty stuff, makeup. And I'm going to World Market to look at some coffee beans actually. We had a viewer comment and say that we need to check out the coffee beans in here, so that's what I'm gonna go do. Flavored coffee. This is the one that McKenna suggested. Costa Rican world market. She even said I could grind them here. I don't really know how to grind them. Do I have to have someone help me from the store? Here's here's the grinder. There's something in the way. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> I'm such a coffee noob. You should just think about me. Does it smell good over here? It smells amazing. Because we just ground some coffee beans. So you you pick up the bag and then you grind it? Yeah, you grind it. Smell good? That one kind of smells like a fart, but... <laughs> well, this is the one that uh, McKenna suggested. That one does smell good. Yeah. It's very strong. Okay, so that's the process. And uh, after I figured it out, I'm excited about this. It's going to be good. Can't wait to get home and try some. What's up? Back home, and I'm gonna try out this Costa Rican Tarazu coffee that McKenna suggested. Thank you again, McKenna, for the suggestion. I have ground the beans as you have seen, and uh, now I'm going to try them. Now I put up my other coffee maker because it was taking up a lot of space. That space right there. So I'm just gonna use the Keurig and use this little filter. I'm not thrilled about that but I, I I may I just may have a better way to grind or make coffee soon we'll see oh, it smells so good though man all right I'm gonna try this I read that you're not supposed to fill this thing up if you want a good cup of coffee so I'm not gonna fill it all the way up okay so there is one tablespoon of coffee in there. I hope this works. Cure egg. The real question is which mug should they use? I'm feeling my Alabama mug. Okay. Cure egg is set. I'm gonna go for uh, let's just try the six ounce because I feel like that's gonna give me the most flavor first. Okay. Now, I also um, grind, ground, I really need to look up the verbs and how to pass them. I made uh, really fine grinds, which I read in some Keurig machines is a bad thing because it can seep through, but I guess we'll find out, huh? Hmm. 
This is the problem I have with the other other cups of coffee that I've had through the Keurig. They just don't taste good. And I know, McKenna, it's not your coffee. I know it's not. Because it tastes exactly like the other cups of coffee that I've had through the Keurig. They just, uh, they just don't taste good. They just don't taste like good cups of coffee. Which is why I'm going to have to do something about that soon. We'll have to find another way to brew coffee soon. But McKenna, I've still got your coffee. And as soon as I get that other method, I'm going to try it. I'm excited. Hanging out on the floor? I am. This is my special spot today. Yeah? How's things? Things are great. Things are great. When I my mom to get me, to get me, pick me up from, <laughs> pick me up from daycare. Because? It's the shower day. Two Liz. Not the Liz in Canada. That's a pretty cool Liz though. That is a cool Liz. But my sister-in-law Liz is pretty cool too. She is. It's still a pretty gross day. I don't see that changing in our forecast. In our forecast. <laughs> it's just so gross. But I am thankful for rain jackets. It has been a lovely day. The clips you just saw were from um, the baby shower, Liz's baby shower. Anna said that it was a lovely shower. Lots of awesome gifts for Liz. Lots of people there to support her. Um, and we wish her and Steven the best. And we pray for health for her and her new growing family. I'm sitting here about to go to bed, thinking about going to bed and I just realized that like this next week is my last full week as just a freelancer full time. And it's just kind of crazy thinking about that. I say it's my last full week. It's, I mean, <laughs> you know, I could freelance again full time in the future. It's not like this is a forever change, but it's just interesting to think about that. And I know I keep talking about it and I know you may be tired of it, but I'm just, it's exciting and it's just this new thing in my life. and. Thank you for all your congratulations and uh, sounds good and everything else that you guys have been talking about uh, in the comments. You're, you're all very supportive and I'm very excited about it. And eventually I'll stop talking about it, I promise. <laughs> but it's just cool. Like I've said, I am wrapping up freelance projects. And, you know, I got an email from someone and they said, Randy, we got another project for you, ready for you to start on it. And it was a freelance client. And I'm just kind of like, whew. That's weird to turn them down and tell them, hey, I actually have a full-time job. Sorry, I can't take on your, your project. That's weird. It's weird. It's just so odd, so different, and it, it kind of hurts a little. Not in a bad way, just in a weird way of like, I don't know, whenever a client would come to me and say, we've got a project for you, I, I get excited. I feel like there's actually a rush of adrenaline in my body, and I'm like, ooh, yeah, let's talk about it. Negotiate the money, the deal. The timeline, oh, fun, you know, like, it's just exciting. And now it's kind of like, I can't. <laughs> I mean, I'm, I may could, but I would just have no time, no free time. And it wouldn't be fair to them, it wouldn't be fair to my employer, it wouldn't be fair to Anna. So, uh, yeah, sorry. 
<laughs> and I think that's it for us today. Hope you guys have enjoyed your ride. If you have, hit that thumbs up. Leave a comment down below. We'll talk to you guys very soon because we love you guys, and we'll talk to you then. God bless.